Emergency workers fought to revive a young victim airlifted to Guyana's capital, Georgetown, on Monday after a fire tore through a secondary school dormitory overnight, killing at least 19 children and injuring several others. Emergency services said the building in the central city of Madia was completely engulfed in flames by the time firefighters arrived. Captain Gerald Gavaya is Guyana's national security advisor. This is a day that will live in infamy for us because these children did not deserve to die like this. It's a day for mourning for all of us, for this country. Um, every man, woman and child and every, certainly every, every parent, will be, their heart will go to the parents of those children. Um, and I know today the president is going to be going to visit those parents, meet with the people, see what is it that we could do and to understand what really happened here. Gavaya said lightning, thunder and heavy rain complicated rescue efforts. But he added the pilots were all very determined to transport the victims quickly. Some 20 students were rescued. An investigation into the cause of the fire is underway.